Yeah, so I plan on playing only the first episode of the DLC. Only the first one. Here we go, expansions. Oh, I'm excited. Apparently the this only goes for about thirty minutes. A fan. The dictionary definition of the word is an enthusiast. Fervent devotee, an abbreviation of fanatic. What comes across to an outsider as a dangerous obsession or even madness is something entirely different from the point of view of the fan herself. To be a fan is a joyous existence, one filled with the happiness that stems from knowing with utter clarity the purpose of your life. But what if that purpose could be more still? If you could be lifted out of the flock as your idols have chosen it were, the only one who could decipher his secret messages. <laughs> what lengths would you go to save the object of your obsession in Ah, uh, flashbang. Night Springs. Tonight's cult classic episode, number one fan. <laughs> so it's like what Sam Lake said in the thing, uh, the showcase last night, and what my friends told me. So these are what if scenarios. These are like multiverse. <laughs> but that's okay. Your destiny has eyes like sunsets and a beard like Mahogany. Oh my god, it's just. You don't really mind how it arrives. Whoa, that was creepy. What the hell was Alan doing in there? But my day didn't start off with all that excitement. It began like any other day did for this waitress slash protector of the town of Night Springs. I figured I'd stop playing this, so sweet. As always, Night's Diner was the hottest spot in town, so there was plenty of work to do. It's everyone's favorite waitress. What's going on? Hi, everyone. Did I get another cup of that delicious special brew that only you know how to make? Of course. Who else wants a top up? Me. Right here, please. Yo, what would you. So the same, there's a special brew of coffee only I know how to make. Will do. Let me just grab a fresh that guy's out to kill me. Why? Why is he the only one? Dispense really good. Come here three times a day. Three times. That's, that's a bit. That's excessive. Excessive. Fucking creep. Hot coffee. I She's more of like a stalker. That writer was named best fan site in the world. Congratulations. Why does everyone love her? Here you go. A person of your genius and grace is wasted serving coffee to us regular Joes and Joettes. Oh, I don't mind. Here's your coffee. How do you juggle running this diner? Your bird century. Is that amazing fan? Bird sanctuary? Where the fuck's the bird That's sanctuary? Coffee. Better put this pot back. I loved being the very successful owner and operator of the county's. You own this place? Diner. But that was nothing compared to my brief fire of passion for the writer and his sheer literary talent. And flowing hair and lips like buttery pie crust. Hi! I need 
to clear the empty pie plates from the tables. Shucks. The writer lives just outside town in that mansion of his. Why don't you what? talk to him? Out Wait, he lives here? Oh, we have our own ways of talking. I saw the news that you saved every single kid from that. Yo, what the fuck happened in this world? Uh, anything by Alan Wake, honestly. Oh, you have got to read the newest book in the Writer's Prime trilogy. I'll grab you a coffee from the back. Wait, I'm confused. Why does she? No time for that. I've got customers waiting. Wait, why does she have this book stored in here? Thank you so much for taking my six from the court. What? What the fuck? By America's best-selling writer. So that's from Alan Wake, I'm guessing. Alan Wake. Alan Wake. Oh my fucking god! What did you do to? Me? What did you do to my boy? She's fucked up. She's fucked up Alan Wake. <laughs> Alan Woke. That's the toilet. I thought we had to grab him a coffee from the back. Guess, guess not yet. I have to get a book from the back. Get him a book from the back. Is it, I'm guess is it one of these then? No? And me, your favorite writer whose voice you would recognize in your sleep. I'm in danger. Please, my number one fan. You're the only one who can save me. I'm on my way. My beloved writer was in terrible danger, and I had to rescue him. The stakes had never been higher. <laughs> Luckily, I kept all my accessories in the diner's kitchen. What accessories? Who cooks here? My accessories. Everything oh my god! Hunting rifle with a gorgeous walnut stock. Deadly and looks good doing it. <laughs> Just like me. I was finally ready for a night out on the town with danger. She just casually keeps a fucking armory back here. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, praise me. Why does everyone love me? I, I feel like Spider Man from I feel like Toby Maguire. I feel like Toby Maguire from Spider Man. Spider-Man Spider 3 was like, they all love me. Oh my god. I was leaving my old life behind. Like a body left to sink in a lake so no one finds it. Nothing would get between me and my future with the record. 
in a way, you could also say this is kind of like a prequel to Alan Wake 2. Because Rose was the, technically the one that helped save Alan. Is Alan Wake? Is that him? I thought it was at the mansion. That's Alan. I knew you'd come to his rescue. Who are you? And why do you look like a slightly less handsome version of my writer? Oh, don't you ever compare me to that worthless hack. Sure, I may be his wild and rebellious estranged twin brother, but we can't all be perfect. I had no idea he had a brother. To think there were two of him all this time. After today, there won't be. No more writer, no more books, no more living in the shadow. But you're his brother. Yeah, but you're his brother. I'm sure you two can talk it out. You realize you have so much in common. And after you change, you can move in together. And I'll come over with popcorn for movie nights. <laughs> he had his chance for popcorn and movie nights, but he wanted to keep everything for himself. Too bad. You know what they say? If you can't join him, beat him. What did you do to him? I locked Mr. Fancy Pants up somewhere you'll never find him. You won't get away with this. I'll stop you. Babe, I got an army of people that hate that hack almost as much as I do. They're ready to die if it stops him from writing another crappy book. What do you got? I have a shotgun. I have a shotgun. Well, I got a <laughs> Wait, is that That's a real shotgun? Okay, I admit that's uh I, I didn't expect that. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't you can't stop all of us. Only a monster could be blind to the poignance of my writer's books. There's only one way to deal with monsters. Oh shit. I forgot you play this. Yeah. Oh my god. Hey. Oh my god, I'm about to die. Oh my god, I'm about to die. There we go. Oh my god, what is going on? <laughs> is it just a point and shoot? Brother's name is so the so the writer has to be Alan Wake and the writer and the twin brother has would have to be Scratch, wouldn't it? Was an unlimited supply of black coffee and crippling emotional trauma caused by the untimely death of my spouse. What uh, is she going on about? Death of her spouse. More haters. Oh, 
Oh, one hit KO. One shot KO. Oh, yo, this, this action, this fucking rifle's OP as shit. Okay, no. Speak to yourself, loser. I you not? Who is, is this? Oh, it's one. Why? Well, I don't have a flashlight. I just realized this is during the day, not night. I ate my spinach this morning. So don't mess with me. Why hadn't my writer ever told me he had a semi evil twin brother? Yeah, scratch. It's just scratch. Waiting until our third or fourth date. Surrounded by candles. So he could reveal this vulnerable chapter from the dramatic story of his emotionally troubled past. She's fucking delusional. Man has more layers than a croissant. That now that's a what's we call it? Is that a metaphor or a similar? Cycle tracks ended at a cabin. There's the motorbike. It's not, it's not Alan. It. I'm here. I've come to save you. Oh, joy. We can finally be together and sit through big poetry readings and drink $18 cocktails. And nah, it's, it's... Tea with the queen. Wait a minute. My writer only drinks coffee. Two sugars, no milk. I keep all the mugs. Okay. No more. Yes, yeah, so I thought. He's gonna try and right, absolutely annihilate my anus, I isn't he? Writing doesn't run in the family. Where are you? I was never upstairs. I lied when I said there were no more tricks. You're starting to peeve me off, Mister. Where is my writer? I'm just having a little fun. Shut down the beach. Lies. First, he kidnaps my writer. Then he calls him a tea drinker. He had crossed the line. I was going there to go that beach and give this jerk the scolding of a lifetime. Hey, me and my bike were just enjoying the view. Um. Where is my writer? What do you even see in that crybaby? He's boring. He dresses like a nerd. Hush your mouth. He is a stylish intellectual who is in touch with his feelings. You're starting to cramp my style, babe. <laughs> but I'm not telling you where he is. Tell me or else. Why are you doing this? What did he ever do to you? I, uh, already told you that? At the boatyard? I feel overshadowed. By success, like he's taken everything I can compete. Oh, right. I remember now. It's a self-confidence thing. Uh, w well, it's a bit more complicated than that. You are going to tell me where he is, or else. Or else what, babe? <laughs> you asked for it. You are rude. You have no manners. Your too cool to care attitude is attractive initially, but drives people away after they realize you're emotionally incapable of letting your walls down to reveal that you are a vulnerable human being just like everybody else. You are trying way too hard for that outfit. <laughs> you... No, stop. I don't like being seen. Listen, I never had your precious writer. I was just keeping you distracted while my army of haters stormed this mansion. Now the love of your life is doomed. 
What are these wolf things? Hey! even going on at this point. Hey! Yeah, we're going to get to the nursing home. Hey! Bad boy! God, she's got annihilated. My God, she sees Alan Wake as Jesus Christ. You're the only one who can save me. I believe in you. My writer believed in me. We were kindred spirits. We fit together like a bicycle chain and wheel thing the chain fits into we were connected by love i don't even know what that's called a cog he was meant to be mine always and forever there was no time to lose i was the only one who could save the writer and the very soul of literature from these evil haters the fate of all art rested on my shoulders the stakes <laughs> the bad boy What a I shotgun, remember? Neither am I. Way. Werewolf. Oh my god, he, he actually is a werewolf. No. 
<laughs> what the fuck is going on? Why can't I? I couldn't even use my buttons. No time to lose. I was the only one who could save the writer and the very soul of literature from these evil haters. The fate of all art rested on my shoulders. The stakes have never been higher. If I have to stop you myself, I will. Unlike him, I'm not afraid to get my hands dirty. <laughs> Uh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Again, I can't shoot. I can't shoot. I can't do anything. Here we go. Kill him? Talk to the bad boy. I hear you. Go ahead. Finish me up. <laughs> okay. Shit just turned into twilight. With my shotgun. Oh shit! Oh my god. <laughs> Did she work here in the main game? God, I've got so much shotgun bullets, I'm just gonna spam all of them. <laughs> okay, I thought I shot his leg off.
Oh my god. Rose is like menace. What a menace, Roses. Roses is a menace. I watch it not be Alan. <laughs> it is. And there he was. That <laughs> smile. Fighting, we were finally alone. And you're covered in blood. God, what the fuck did? What was that? <laughs> it's sad. And the object of her joy come together against a world trying to keep them apart. A happy ending for some. But his happiness, like beauty, all in the eye of the beholder. Where is the line between fantasy and fixation? One can never tell. In like springs. Yo, what the fuck is this? We got a new song to bop to now. We got Herald of Darkness, now we got this. Two. Fuck, we'll do episode two and do episode three tomorrow night. Young woman on a mission to save the missing one. Desperately trying to stay one step ahead of the shadowy government agents hunting her. Agents from the very same agency that took the only person she cares about. On her quest, she is guided by her mysterious alien guardian angel. Her guiding star shows her the way, as it always is. Oh, we're playing as Jesse. She does not know what strangeness awaits her as she follows its unwavering light to the small town. Yeah, you can hear this. Night Springs. Oh, it's the town of Night Springs. Not the night's dreamlike episode. North Star. You see, teleplay by Alan Wynn. This is gonna get strange. Uh, it's the same voice actor. There's no helping it. Oh, this is this is them just wanting to do a control to. My brother and I know. We've seen it. They know that we want to. They know that the fans want to control control to, and they're just not giving it to us. That doesn't want anyone knowing more than what they see. That's why they took my brother, and have been chasing me my whole life. But I can't keep. Jesse, we're going to coffee world. Um, oh, okay. You think something here's important? Yeah. What? The numbers? Uh two three eight? Is that the code? Oh, 
fucking love control, man. I've never been able to track down the government agency that took my partner. Until now. Oh, so this, so it's Jessie, but it's not the Jessie from the control wall because she, she, she found. Hello. She found the people who took her brother. She already found her brother in the actual control game. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Two, three, eight again. No. Um. Don't have a gun or anything. Um. Coffee time. Okay, I'm getting battery. That means I'm getting a flashlight soon. Well, okay, I just saw a TV. Oh. Why does an amusement park need a welcome center? No tape. So I can just run past them. Well, I can actually go back here then. Here we go. Oh, it's so cool because in control, the... The gazebo? The thing that guides her. Hey, Tim Brinko! Ma'am, here. Get inside the light. Oh, they don't like the light. You shouldn't be here. How did you even get inside? Shit. A cop. Should I lie? I... Kind of let myself in. You got more than you bargained for, huh? What's going on here? What are those shadow... people? Well, that's what I'm here trying to figure out. The government's been putting something in the coffee. Turning people into coffee monsters. The government? <laughs> Is this the same government agency that's been chasing me all these years? I'm looking for someone. My brother. Have you seen anybody? Only if you count those monsters. I'm sorry. They've been abducting people from Night Springs, too. I'm here to get them back home. But now it's time you've left. It's not safe here. Something in the coffee is doing this? Yeah, what's in the coffee? Really? Took me a while to wrap Drugs? around too. At first, I thought, well, I don't know what I thought, but now it's clear. This is deep state science. I'm not going anywhere until I find my brother. I respect that. There's a warehouse just past the park. It's locked up tight. Has some fancy government security system, but the intercom is busted. I figure that's where they're keeping our missile. There's a, a spare pistol and flashlight on the bench. I bet. I'd feel better if you took them. Those monsters don't do well. With You're very trusting. For all you know, I could be a criminal. Do not drink the coffee. I could be a criminal. I could, I could be a criminal and just end your life right here. You're very trusting. Oh, I already looked at that. Um, look, how do you use the flashlight again? Let's check out that warehouse the sheriff mentioned. Are you still with me? Good to hear. Fucking how? What, what button is it for flashlight? There you go. It's, uh, oh, oh shit. Oh, uh, why? I'm using batteries. Fuck. Um. Figured it out. I need to go over there. Well, at least they know in here is different. What the fucking ritual of coffee? Yo, we, we can already now know that Sam Lake had a field day on this episode. He's like, yes, we're going to have coffee. And it's going to they're going to be monsters. We're going to have like, people doing coffee seances. And the everyone in the studio like, what the fuck you want about? And he goes, coffee. <laughs> God. They give you so much shit. <laughs> um, isn't it? There we go. 
Oh shit. Cornered me into a tree and absolutely had his way with me. I didn't consent to any of that. Let's check out that warehouse the sheriff mentioned. Are you still with me? Imagine that alien's like, nope. I'd feel better if I had a shotgun. Why does it they, <laughs> they give you a shotgun and wait, does that mean we're not even gonna get a shotgun the next one? <laughs> The first one they gave us a shotgun and, and a rifle. This one they gave us a pistol. Whoa, 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 whoa! Trigger happy. <laughs> I went crazy with the bullets there. Her finger game like would be insane. Oh, this must be the warehouse. How do I get inside? I didn't mean it like that. Um, there would have to be a passcode somewhere. Um, very. There anything back here? No, it's not. Hmm. What if I just touch it? Hi, uh, I need to get inside. Sorry, I lost it. Oh, fucking machine. Shoot it. Sure. What's the question? What kind of question is that? Triangle? That is incorrect. What, okay, what if you don't need to find it? What if you can just in, say the word and it just let you in? Coffee. Coffee? Okay, now fuck off. Now I need to find the video. Great. Guys, we need to find that orientation video. Exactly where it is, though. I don't even know where it would be. Coffee Ward in the main game was scary enough, or spooky enough, and now you just put throw me in here with a 300 bullets, with a trigger happy. Oh, uh, go. Maybe it's back there. Yeah, it's just take a take a little do a little, to, do a little snort. No, no, do a little snort. Damn! Oh shit! No hesitation. These were in the game. What was it? This one? That and that? These were in the main game. Ugh. Ugh. 
don't moan like that, Jesse. Um, I don't know where this orientation video is going to be. Uh, guess we have to keep exploring. Sure, it's just on this. Would 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 Tim Breaker know where the video would be? I don't know. Unless he knows what the video off by heart, then then I don't think he'd know. Look, we got another one of these. so much shit. <laughs> Let me cook. Um, so it's not here. I'll check down there. Um, we could always go back to Tim Breaker. Maybe he knows where it is. Tape was missing from the welcome center. I think the password I need is on it. You haven't seen it, have you? Yeah, I've seen it. But that tape is chock full of government brainwashing. I watched a bit and it it was doing something to me. It's dangerous. You can't watch that tape. I need that videotape, Sheriff. Well, this is exactly how they get you. But fine. If you really want it, I hit it in Ferris wheel, cup number four. You'll need this key. Don't say, I didn't warn you. I'll be fine. I've got, um, what's her name? Polaris? Is that the alien? Polaris? Or the thing that guides her? Ferris wheel, cup number four. I gotcha. So it's kind of like... They took like out the main campaign aspects and they just transformed in certain aspects. Took certain aspects and just chopped them in for the episodes. Um, yeah, here we go. Because this is the control sequel. The the new control DLC. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, okay, one, two, three, this is four. Boom, skilled. Creepy and eerie it is. Well, we're, well, I mean, we are in Coffee World. Triangle. Triangle Coffee is a fast-growing company with ambitions to sweep the nation and eventually the globe. With our Adam, this world beverages. It's an ad to make you drink, to hypnotize you to drink coffee. People are rushing to join the Dark Triangle movement. The company's mission statement is simple: to drink the truth. There's to be That's what we need. Password is now we can go. Uh, it's like drink coffee, drink coffee. I'm now fucking your mind with subliminal messages. <laughs> Like a 
voice screaming in my head. To drink coffee. <laughs> but we got what we needed. The fourth word of the mission statement. Truth. <sighs> Let's get back to that warehouse. That video was doing something to me. If you hadn't been turning there, you into a coffee fanatic. What would have happened? What is this agency trying to do here? Make control you drink people? Control That's the name of like that's the name of the game she's from. What if control has already been No. I didn't come all this way to lose him now. This could be the prequel to control. One hundred and eighty. One hundred and eighty? That is incorrect. Please recite the optimal roasting temperature for dark triangle coffee beans in Fahrenheit. Then it's gotta be two hundred. Two hundred. That is incorrect. Uh back to Tim Breaker. Back to I Iceman. Optimal. Get murked. Get murked, buddy. Actually, could it not be here? I've in enough coffee shops to recognize a roasting machine. Let's check this out. Angles of triangle prime numbers. What, so, could it be one, two, one, or two, four, three? So the temperature is higher than... Dark Triangle this Coffee this has an optimal roasting temperature which is greater than the sum of our triangle. The first digit of our roasting school. temperature is the second and the third digit... Is the first digit of our roasting temperature is half of the second and the third digit is one less than the one before. The optimal roasting temperature Prime. Prime. for dark drunk what? coffee is Prime below number? 500 degrees Fahrenheit. 500 degrees is also the number of light years between Earth and planet X13. Is it going to make me do math? Or can I just type in 121? One, 121? One. One, one. I guess they only hire mathematicians here. 243? I don't think these are going to work. No. Hmm. That doesn't seem right. What was this? It's below 500 degrees. don't know. Could we go ask Tim Breaker? Would he know? Would Tim Breaker... Surely he'll know. He seems like the type of dude he'll know. Welcome back. He doesn't know. Great. Um, good talk. I'm going to have to try and do math. Fuck. I didn't want to do that. Okay, that's spinning by itself. Um. A dark triangle lobby has an optimal roasting temperature which is greater than the sum of our triangle. 
what? Oh wait, so the it's the greatest song. So that's 60, 60, 60. Or that 90, 90, 90. No, it would have to be 60. No, it would have to be 60. So 60, 60, 60. That's 60 degrees. That's 120, 200. Wouldn't that be 200? 120. So, no, no, 180. That's 180. That's 180. So 180. Um. So it has an optimal resting temperature which is greater. So it's greater than 180. First digit of a. The first digit of an optimal roasting temperature is half of the second. Half the second and third digit is one less than the one before it. Um, do I just look it up? Do I really just look it up? <laughs> Even Google doesn't even have the fucking answer. Um. So 500. So the optimal roasting temperature of a dark triangle coffee is below 500 degrees Fahrenheit. 500 is also the number of light years between Earth and planet X13. So. Four eight seven. What if it's 13 take 500? No, it can't be that simple. 4, 8, 7. I think that worked. Four hundred. Really? Seven. Who knew geometry would actually come in handy? That wasn't geometry. All the answers were right there. All it was was 500 take 13. Four hundred and eighty-seven degrees Fahrenheit. Four hundred and eighty-seven. That all the. Oh my God! Further. Oh, Great. Uh, gotta go to the tasting room now. It's it, like I said. It's gonna be a seance. So I'm gonna. The coffee. I'm gonna get into the. I'm gonna get into the tasting room. It's gonna absolutely. Good sleep. They're just getting murked. <laughs> Here we go. Here goes nothing. Trusting you. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go tripping out my balls right now. I'm gonna be oh. tripping balls. That wasn't so Better. What was the shooting? Why is Tim Breaker out of the? Are you all right, Sheriff? I heard gunshots. Yeah, no, I'm fine. I was looking for you when one of those things jumped. Got a little bit of coffee in my mouth, but I spit it out. Should be fine. 
to listen. I figured something out. What did you figure out? What did you figure out? Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, yeah, it's nothing. Those government bastards will never get me. <laughs> but it, it's not just the government. There's something else here. I, I, I don't know what it is, but it's... You need to get your brother and get out of here as soon as you can. Promise me. Yeah. I yeah, I promise, Sheriff. Sure. You're what's happening. Good. That's good. I'm just gonna catch my breath here a minute. Huh? Okay. I have to get rid of my gun? I just got killed by, by a dude in a coffee mascot outfit. What if I ask the sheriff for his gun? Oh yes, safety. I've done their bidding, Patrick. The coffee and room. Okay, but no gun. Thanks. Oh, I love a coffee, man. Sheriff. Sheriff. How'd you get in here? Coffee time is family time. <laughs> I don't think it does. I'm so sorry, Sheriff. Can I take your gun? This is a nightmare. I need to find my brother. He has to be okay. Okay, shit's turning into control. This is turning into control now. With the red light. Fuck no. This is just control at this point. That's control. That is straight out of control. It's your brother. Ah, oh, not <laughs> Alan Wake. Oh my god. <laughs> oh 
of what is Alan Wake with Jesse's sister. Oh, that's it. Conspiracy within a conspiracy. How can one expose a lie when the truth exists beyond our wildest imagination? Who can ever truly know how deep the rabbit hole goes? <laughs> Night okay, sing it to me. Fucking bot! Hey, Wallendor. We often look back and wonder, what if? What if the path not taken had in fact been our charted course? Would we be happy? Or are we, with our set of choices behind us, the lucky ones? And what if nothing would be different? What if for some of us, our destiny across the endless number of versions of ourselves has been defined and locked beyond any causality of circumstance, beyond the forces in any one reality, but across all realities. For one man, the magnetic... Fuck. What destiny is so great it breaks time and space. We join this lone operative, many versions of him in fact, Many versions Jesus of them. Jesus' nemesis, a dangerous being known as the master of many worlds. Yeah, you. Across the multiverse, across the many versions of a city that is always the same, yet always different. In the... Night Springs. Night Springs. Tonight's reality-bending episode, Time Breaker. Time... Time Breaker? It's, it's Tim Breaker. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Why, you think an actor? Was that okay? I mean, I can do more. I can do less. Yes. Sam Lake. Yes. Yes. Sean. <laughs> talk i love your instinct on this but we can still push this further immerse ourselves into this story believe in it make it, is it do you reckon this is how sam like actually like, treats his actors <laughs> this is only what he's actually like you wanted to talk it's awesome to be doing this with you again, Sam. Sean, it's so good to have you back. Been dreaming this for so long, and now finally. Oh my God! The fucking it's time breaker, the video game. It's happening. Time breaker. Oh my and God! It's quantum so break. Of course. <laughs> this <laughs> quantum break. As well. I'd like to talk about my character. Just get deeper into the lore. Whoa. I could talk about this for days. He's a multiversal agent. Goes by many names as there are many versions of him. Breaker, Branch, others. He's searching for his lost love while his ruthless nemesis, Dor, <gasps> the Dor, master Wall of Dor. Worlds, is murdering versions of him across parallel realities. He must track down and stop Dor. That's so cool. You've done cool superhero roles in the past. Long term, the agent will Yeah, grow yeah, he's done Iceman. Iconic superhero. Oh, that's awesome. Uh about my gadget. Your 
vision of the multiverse. You clearly have your own vision um, of the multiverse. The right vision, the true, it's all out there. That's where these ideas and inspirations come from. They seep through. Somewhere this here a stalking is part of the video game, and another version of you is playing. Somewhere your character, the agent, is real, and he could appear here through a portal any time now. Right. Yeah, yeah, right, Sam. <laughs> you are a maniac, man. Totally. So the vortex and the gadget. I'm... <laughs> Sorry, I keep forgetting its name. There's there's just so many acronyms here. But it helps me travel through realities. Acronyms are cool, right? Like tiny mysteries. You power up your PRS, polyhedron reality shifter, with an SEN shifter energy node. Oh my god. I'm not remembering that TV bullshit. And write the vortex between realities. It's all REC, Ripple Effect Corporation Tech. And you have a gun and a TPS, Time Breaker Solidifier, to defend yourself. <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. So, um, what do we shoot next? We need to set up for the next scene. Where your nemesis pulls you into a parallel reality. You can go to your green room, chill out, learn the lines. I left the latest draft of the screenplay for you there. See you in a bit. Cool. Can't wait. Sometimes it's hard to tell if Sam's joking. That deadpan Finnish humor. And a reputation of being a bit out there. I picked up a weird vibe when he talked about the multiverse. Yeah, because in this in this game it's real. <laughs> so this this game kinda So this episode here so far seems like it's solidifying that episode one and two are canon within Alan Wake 2, but Multiverse. It's like like I'm um, or said at the beginning of each episode. It, these are like what if scenarios. Oh my oh, god. Wallendor. Fuck was that? Hello. Oh, it's me. The fuck is this? I thought I'd gone mad. Then I realized Sam was playing a crazy prank on me. There's no way this was real. Sunlit Branch. Oh my god. Alan Wake's been at it again! He's been writing shit again! <laughs> tin Breaker written by Sam. Time Breaker. Fucking time, not Tim. I had to admire how real the body and the props look. So we got another. Jesse! Again. Excuse me? <laughs> no, th this is just. It's a prank. It's just a prank. Wait, are you. Shit. You're not Branch. No, he's dead. Very much dead. Oh, at least I got a gun. Are you cast in this game, too? Listen. We are on this team. Like what? You must do exactly what I tell you. Ah! He's fucking my mom with some little more messages! Ah! Why is my hair so long now? This is probably why the DLC took so long, cause I blanked out and I was suddenly Sean Ashmore had to grow his hair out and his beard. I had my memory before, but that's the movie Which star lifestyle for you. This was something else entirely. The last thing I remembered was the red-headed woman at the door. She looked familiar. She was trying to tell me something, and then it went dark. You look familiar because you met her in episode two. Think, Just not think, this version think, of yourself. A different I version. A psychotic episode? He's gone crazy. Was man's got that Kurt Russell. All. Did Sam do this? An elaborate hoax? Hairstyle now. Wall, method acting reality show. It had gone way too far. Okay, okay. Yeah, let's let's go with that. Act like this is true. Okay. I'm an actor. I can do this. Once it's over, Night Spring we'll City Park, Parallel Reality Bleed then, Zone. Cross dimensional with normally no trespassing is rare. Whoa. <laughs> Alright, 
Oh wait, I think I know where I am. I needed to find an energy node and use this rod thing with it, the PRS, was it? And look for some kind of TV to get the hell This is out like of the here. starting area to the main game. Is it not? Yeah, it is. Not a loop, it's a spiral. <laughs> Everything's an Alan Wake reference now. Luma Vista TV. According to what Sam had said, I needed the energy. The other me had hidden away from this trailer. Oh, away from this trailer. He's the chosen one. Yes. Yes. He's hidden the energy node in the creek in the forest. I have to find it. I have no idea where the creek is. This way? Is the creek this way, or you yeah, know, yeah, this is the creek, isn't it? It has to be around here somewhere, then, right? Down this way? No, that's blocked. Um, so I'm guessing that's not the creek. Well, it is probably the creek, but it's probably up here. I have zero clue. Um I had to find the creek. That's where the other Oh my god, I just, energy oh my god, I just went in circles. There. Oh there it is. Just like in the video game. I've got a gun! It's no hoax. No video game. It's really happening. I was lost in the multiverse. I had to become the role to survive. I am Tim. I, had to I am Time Breaker. Use my PRS on it. Dora would be coming for me next. I didn't want to face him. Fuck that. No, face him. I couldn't shake the feeling that it was inevitable. What could he possibly do? get out of here. I felt a strange pull from the vortex on the screen. Yo, he's got a mustache now. Ocean View Hotel. Uh oh. I'm not way. I was in a different reality. 
but not better, worse. Maybe by thinking of Dor, I traveled closer to him, to where he was so, in control. Next so, time, I'd focus on something else. So what if the Tim Breaker that we keep seeing in the Alan Wake, um, like in the Alan Wake story, in the main game, is actually different versions of Tim? Because of the whole multiverse thing with what's happening to him. That's why he's getting around so much and he can more multiverse science battle. And he doesn't know what the fuck's going on. Oh no, nah. the ocean view motel is fucked. Yes, yeah, so it is a loop. That's the TV though. Luma Vista TV. I just needed energy to power. I couldn't hear the thoughts of the other me, the one native to this reality. Maybe Dor had killed him already. Not a happy thought. I had to find the right version of the body in the right time when what I needed was there. <laughs> Way! Banky's like jump scaring me. Shit! Ah! Damn. The was broken here. The corridors led to the same lobby, but in different times. Ah. Um, which way should I go then? Fucking this way? Do I just, is there, is there like, do you just keep running through doors and you eventually just find? The clocks showed the way. Ah. They guide me through to get what I needed. Entertainment lobby, tango lobby, coffee lobby. Oh, coffee lobby. It's Artie singing! <laughs> I really wish, I really wish he stopped fight. Quantum break now. A strange place. How do I feel? It looped there around we. like in a dream. Uh, maybe there was logic to it. Finding uh, the right route to get through. It's always the the time right to the. Oh, so oh, so you so the clock. So um, let's go to the coffee lobby. Nine o'clock. So that's not it. That's not it. Here we go. Nine o'clock. Same thing, coffee, tango, entertainment. Should I try entertainment then? Should I just... Entertainment... This is entertainment here then. Imagine them just making an actual another game called Time Breaker and it's just Quantum Break. Here we go. Oh, so that's how you, so that's the TV room, this is the TV room. Um, let's try the Tango Lobby, 3 o'clock. Um, 3 o'clock, it's 9 o'clock, 3 o'clock. Yeah. 
Okay. We've already been here. So this 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 is the wrong one as well then. Oh wait, what's in here? Could I possibly change the clock site time? No. Hmm. What if I actually like, went off track? Like this one here, for example, is the wrong time on any of the things, so maybe. No. That didn't work. Um... Emily, the time is up to you. Did you oversleep? Was that our morning lobby for the never-ending breakfast buffet, craving one of the delicious Cocktail stop by the six o'clock lobby with cocktail hours in full time frame. Just follow the clock. Hmm. So what if I just keep going off track? That's nine o'clock, three o'clock, twelve o'clock. They're, they're, they're all the right times though. Hmm. Nine o'clock again? What if I just keep, what if I just pick one and just stick with it, just keep going 9 o'clock? I'm so confused where... Um, no. That's 3, that's 12. I'm so confused where I need to go. What the fuck? Help, I need help! Let me out! Um... I don't get it, like... Um... That just leaves me back there, 12 o'clock... Like, here's the TV. But I can't do anything. I need to char I need to charge the my magic wand. But I don't know where you go to get the charge. No one a poison pill had mentioned they'd made a comic book of their game. But then maybe poison pill didn't even exist in this reality. I was in a comic book. Funny. Uh, you played a comic book character, my guy. You're Iceman. An X-Man. Maybe if there's like a hidden clock or something, like... That has to be something, like... Pointing me in the direction, right? These are just... It's nine o'clock. I'm so confused where I need to go. I have a feeling I have something to do with this room. I have a feeling there's something to do in here. I, I still don't understand. Do I go? Should I go back to six o'clock then? Wait. Ah, 
blacking out. I thought I was cooking with something. I thought if I if I went in and went back. Actually, I could try doing that when I go into the new room. I could like here. Cause what if I went back that way? Would it just lead me into a different room? Same room? I am so confused where I need what I need to do. I think I'm retarded. Yeah, I think I'm retarded. Maybe maybe I have to go entertainment tango coffee. Maybe that's Maybe it's a certain order I need to go in. So, twelve three nine. So twelve. That what I need to do? There, ah, I'm fucking genius. The PRS was charged up. Now, now entertainment. What well, was entertainment? It was at twelve, wasn't it? When I used the TV to travel between realities, I was thinking of Thor, and the vortex brought me here, where the time breakers attacked me. Whoa. Oh, fuck. Flashbang. I was so confusing on what I needed to do. It was actually this pretty time. simple once you think about it. I'm just, I think I'm just dumb. My stupid ADHD brain. Whoa, epileptic attack! I'm in a comic book! <laughs> Imagine he turns into Iceman in this. Like text read out loud. Is Ripple Effect just you. by the I time view everything? Thor pulled you away. Jesse. Thought you were gone. For sure. I focused on you when I entered the vortex. I, I was trying to reach you. Is that not, not the, um... Archie! Wait, so is this just not the place from Control? Real and not real exist side by side in the multiverse. Echoes flow through it like currents in a cosmic ocean. A sea of night. Conceptual, fictional, real. More real than real. Many versions of us all in hidden interaction linked by the energies that ripple through realities. One of you is killed in an explosion of dangerous energy, and another one instead gains superpowers. Control! Yet another one meets an alien In one reality, not even real. Or is 
you say. Characters. A video game. Damn, they're breaking the Why fourth wall. Who is Dorn? There are legends about him going back further than we can trace. They say he found an opening to a horrifying parallel reality that consumed him. Gave him access to all realities. The feedback loop killing all other versions of him. I am on the threshold. Is that just. Isn't there a reference to that in Alan Wake 2? Like they talk about how. I forgot the guy's name, but he died at Cauldron Lake. of you as a threat he's killing them why bringing them back as time breakers we thought he was after branch no he thought he's off me now i'm thinking he's been after you because i'm the main character Alan Wake. Picking up speed. I've just been after you. Don't fool me. You travel through realities with greater accuracy than anyone I've ever seen. Beyond Dora, even. You picked it up just like that. Finding the place that made him may be the key to killing him. That was our theory. Now we can never find it. Maybe you can. be continued. So is that it? Surely not. So what the fuck? <laughs> Shit just turned into Undertale. What the fuck is going on? What the hell is going on? I am so confused. Shit just, shit just turned into like Street Fighter graphics. Oh! Oh fuck! I'm in him. I'm I'm in another man. 
Oh, I'm dead. How do I heal? How do I heal? Jojo pose. Imagine this was just in my Max Payne universe. I've been brought to the very edge of the multiverse. Whoa. There's some deep, dark trench in it. Everything is sucked dry of color and energy. Shit just turned into control. I'm just killing myself over and over again then. TV in the distance? Oh, that looks like a TV in the distance. You have gone astray. I've gone astray? Oh, yeah, yeah okay. How, I, how have I gone astray? <laughs> Stop fucking my mind. I don't consent. Oh shit! Shoot him! Oh yeah, no GGs. Oh yeah, no GGs. Oh no, GGs. Oh my god. God. Dream of sleep, you come to gradually become aware of the utter lack. There is nothing. Focus, go back to the focus. Search for something to focus on. An idea of a geometric shape comes to your mind. A pentagonal which appears. Oh my god, is that control reference? How do you know the name of the shape that you don't know? You feel yourself fading, drifting apart, losing your essence in the stream of consciousness. 
the ebbs, the flows of your thoughts. Hold yourself together. You fight to hold yourself together to swim against the current, to break the, to the surface. Come to focus, you realize your first impression was wrong. There is something in the... Focus on the thought. Imagine a cup of coffee. That has to be the answer, right? What the hell is going on? <laughs> oh, whoops, I didn't mean to pick that. Meditate to learn. Go north. Go north. Go north. Go north. Go north. Crawl north. Channel your mind. Look at the seed, take the seed. T uh, take the seed. Eat the seed. Embrace the feeling. Become the world tree. Go and expand your knowledge. Pick up the branch. Because my name, the, the uh, multiversal name of myself was Branch. Uh, pick up the fruit. Can all the men lying on the ground play? He seems weak and ill, moaning to himself. Something stirs in your mind. I forgot a memory of. Oh wait! <gasps> oh, oh um, it's me. What the fuck is- oh my god. I'm being hacked. My IP address is now being leaked. I'm cooked. We have witnessed a case of mistaken identity. But in the vastness of the multiverse, with an endless number of versions of ourselves, what is identity anyway? But Dora only has one Can identity. Be more than one master of many worlds? Or did our hero take a wrong turn somewhere along the way? Was this particular journey precisely what was needed to make him one he was meant to become? One thing is certain. I am your host. The one and only Warlin Poor. And this is Night Springs. Hell yeah. So the different endings for it then? 